Hello and welcome everybody back to the League of Ungentlemen Warfare with NO1800. In the last episode we actually managed to um, get the scepter and in this episode now we are going to probably finish the quest line by escorting the queen out of this area and maybe we'll also be able to get to our first engineers. I'm going to ignore actually the rum because that just takes a lot of space away uh, in the new world. Instead we are going to establish a new cotton production for transport and yeah that is going to be glorious and also I will try everything that I can do in order to get more influence. Unfortunately for that I need a lot more population and stuff like that, I so could simply go to press. it won't be that easy. You in especially good humor, Governor. But hey. really? Because I really want to uh, start building the palace here, but without demolishing what we had already built in our other region um, at the old capital in regards of zoo and museum, because it would simply be too nice to destroy. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Ah, now the discovery is coming. So, um, now we got a new animal here. One more piece in our set. Second battleship should also soon arrive. Yep, there they are coming. And then I should have everything ready for the escort. Aside from that, I should maybe stop with the production of airships because we have quite a lot now. Oh, I'm not even producing them anymore because they cost a lot of influence. Hopefully the amount of influence that we have will skyrocket as soon as we also have investors here. And slowly but steadily I can also start to get rid of some of these internal buildings. Like for example the marketplace which is well, not needed anymore. Earlier earlier, I was under the impression that it actually has a, uh, an impact on the um, newspaper, but that is actually not the case. Drank as lords! Drank on life! Your ship has returned from its voyage. I'm yeah, really looking forward to see all of that completed. Action. Okay, so and you got some machines. Electricity, that is nice, glass makers and light bulb factories. And in theory, we could now actually improve our soap production a lot, but our city is actually not consuming that much soap. So that is not necessary yet. 
one day I will also have gotten rid of um, all this industry over here. Okay, now we have a couple of better ships available. Would be a shame if we would not use them. Engines underway. Oh, look at that! There's a signal coming in. Well, it's high time I return to rescue poor old Archie. He may Hi otherwise have to drink about his bowels. Look after Crown Falls for me, won't you? I only really care for the taxis now. Room to maneuver. Ooh, we found 46 tons of jewelry. That is nice. And I didn't want to pause the game. Yeah, time to start for the escort. Attention for the Admiral. And let's see if now something bad happens, because otherwise the escort should not have been requested. about the new world. We still have so many islands available. But we lack to, the influence to settle on them. Ah, so much space available. One day, we will settle that all. business and become a pillar of our nation stations that is what I'm trying to do one headline dominates the front pages after great source of both the city and the nation kebab lord has been officially appointed warden of Trelawney and governor of Crownford at a grand cer a ceremony conducted by her majesty the queen empress royal of the southern territories well would have been nice if I would actually have seen that ceremony but fleet on the moon the people celebrate your leadership. But apparently that was too much to ask for. So sad. Waiting course. Okay then. Um I've a wealth of parts. Sure. Real odds and ends. What do we actually need for that one? That is fairly reasonable. On our way. The epidemic spreads across your city. Corona, of course. Game save. Ah, wrong world here. So the first epidemic of left buildings abandoned. A few 
few sundries. So, and we need 15 tons of quartz. By oh, the way, do we also... What are the other things here? So, increase the chance of finding items of rarity, epic and legendary while diving. Yeah, that would also be nice. But I'm actually okay with what Bring I got. Around. So again, 15 tons of quartz, and that is something that we can do. On our way. The festival has ended. Bring her around. The city has grown uglier. Oh, it's so nice when money does not have any meaning at all anymore. Oh my, I don't have quartz. As it seems. Do I actually have my own glass production? I don't even think so. Well, good thing that can be solved quite easily. That would actually be quicker than traveling through uh, to another sector. Maybe out about this place? And now the amount of quartz that we are getting is rising. So, um, how many records do we actually need here? Um, five. That's a bit a, uh, a little bit low, especially considering on how much we are going to. Increase the size of a city. New orders. On our way. Happy melodies spring, all perfectly legal. So here we have the flying cotton. Nice scrap. I'm pretty sure I also have that. At least if I find it again. Here it is. Yeah, I got 110 tons, so. Hold the crane. So oh, now you should be happy, Nate. Did we actually get a reward for that? Game save. Not really. One final look.
we have taken to calling you the master, among many other complimentary monikers. It's important to be true to oneself. These people, they need a hero. Any way the wind blows, eh? We will be better without you. So now I got even the long range detection. And oh, still right. not finding much. Oh, wait. So now let's see. I really want to see if uh, there's a bit more than scraps that I can take out of the ocean. If I can really find legendary items and so on without the need of a treasure map. just lose that one item. Apparently they are only timed. Ah, there. That was the reason. I got close enough. Wow, even more scrap. I wish, if you, I wish it would be like, if you get that legendary I item, that about. there's always something displayed. That would make it feel a little bit more rewarding. On our way. Just a theory, though. An explosion in one of your factories. Wow, it's really just more scrap. Room to maneuver. And yay, more explosions. Adequate, but lacking finesse. Alright, I stopped them from actually consuming these goods. Because I was somehow a bit underproducing, or the the trade route capacity did not work properly, something around those lines. I definitely had my reasons. Maybe there is also a set that allows for, well, more, uh, more influence. So, the new world. Um, again, we definitely are the festival going to has ended. some more cotton. The good thing is Your that cotton is production does here. not take up much of workforce. I would love to do it on another island to keep it separated to avoid a small logistical Game nightmare. Safe. And it looks like Abaja is a good fit for this job. There's of 
course, what are you using the cotton for? Uh, you are collecting from both. Okay, I see. Oh. Guess it is time to expand to a little over city here a little bit further. There's already a fire watch, so all we need here is another hospital. On the other hand, I might kill some base production here. Yeah, well, they are already not happy with the amount of punches I've been that I'm worse. producing. Fried plantains. Ah, uh, I actually should avoid that. That was not thought through. I should definitely go more for this island here. Take the rudder. Okay then, let's see. So first of all, if we are going to need at least six, it means I'm calculating with eight. Eight per minute means 7.5. I mean, if I get one of these productions, I can have two per minute. So if I can supply two cotton mills. Three, well, uh, if I get the production down to, yeah, I will, I will go down to 7.5 seconds. I will run short on workforce here on this island. The people celebrate your leadership. At least a little bit. I wish there was an item overview over the entire world. So that you can send them around. Well, all of these I can't use at the moment.
three more and we are all set. That was nearly perfect. Okay. Um, yeah, we are now lacking Three around five percent of the workforce that we need. That is something that we can fix. We definitely have enough wood available. So creating here a very little worker uh, worker settlement. be totally sufficient. Unless of course we are also aiming for building a hospital. Um, yeah, people are unhappy because negative 10 because of E. Because of a little uh, newspaper. The dream seems so far away. Awaiting new horizons. The dream seems so far How away. How thrilling! Yeah. A renowned personage has arrived. Take the rudder. Khadija, welcome aboard. Ready for a challenge. So and once we got with that little worker settlement, we can start building the rest of the needed stuff. Okay. Um So, hopefully this time you're better. Yep, you're better news for me. Isn't that great? So, with those additional resources, I should also be able to increase the storage capacities. Capacity of this island. Otherwise, this might be a little bit problematic if we can only store like 150 tons. Because traveling times are so long in this game. I really believe that some things are done by the developers only to annoy the player. now religion so you don't need food in order to be happy you're only generating a, burst, a basic amount of workforce that is all that I need Now we should have a bit more of storage capacity here. Yep, definitely. Okay, so time to create a new trade route. I really need to do something. An about. explosion in one of your factories. Oh, for fuck's sake.
So trade route, trade route from the new world, Araya Prater to Cape Trelawney. To Havisham. And you will load in cotton fabric. Cotton. Three, three, cotton. And hopefully that will work out. And here we should already have everything that we need. And even the right fertility. So that is now going to be a bit annoying to get all the furs that we need. Um, we need at least eight of these. Eight hunting cabins. Okay, what building material is low here? It's actually the basics. On course. I should be honored. Heading set. So now if we are going for the world map. Should actually quite soonish be able to see how quick that one travels. Drops are spinning. So you're now getting the resources that you need, yeah? As soon as you are leaving the region, we shall see on the world map if you are that much faster than a steamship. And if yes, it only showcases that I definitely need to, well, have more airships. It's interesting, you are not driving straight up north. So if we now go to the world map. Here we see steamships for reference. Yeah, it's safe to say it's twice as fast. <laughs> so yeah, definitely going for more airships. Aside from that, they are actually way cooler. Airship. Okay, in the meantime, all these resources have arrived. That's great. Only issue that I still have with the airships is the selection. Game save. Final look. The idiot is back. Ah, oh, perfect. People are happy.
The festival has ended. Your city has grown uglier. Okay, now we should uh, be. Now we should have enough fur production. And we can now focus on additional means. So we can finally get here the fur dealers. People celebrate your leadership. Drops are spinning. Okay, and you here. Become the people fur coats celebrate deliverer. your leadership. People celebrate your leadership. So now the first fur coats are being delivered. What a time to be alive. Awaiting course. And now you guys can start to be happy. That is in order. And then we can, in the next episode, actually focus on the electricity supply that also ought to be interesting now come on yeah it's the famous last two percent they take a little bit longer in this game I am possessed. Unprecedented. So, and you don't even need a school anymore. And you don't need a church. That is good to know. Radiant Metropolis. We'll need to make some additions. Game save. Yeah, looking quite good so far. As soon I can get rid of a church. And also of that, reposition maybe a few things. may influence her majesty. Ideally, one should keep one's promises. Oh, 
So, and you can now also be upgraded. And now we got our very first engineer district in the city. Ain't that beautiful? We just need to find out where to place the oil power plants. Probably somewhere around here. I will place it in a way that it can actually support an entire district. Maybe even more than that. So now here's also a little park. And yeah, in the next episode, we are going to start with a real oil supply. This place is full and of we will recheck if they actually have a few more needs. And of course we still have to increase our population. Uh, that is going to be so annoying. Yeah, later you are supposed to get to get influence through having more investors, so that is only fair. I'm actually afraid of having another coffee island. But all the other needs are actually quite easy. And we can ignore the luxury goods for now. As long as we have island peace, news nothing remotely well on that one here so there's that that's a game saved it's not even listed here so we have several influences yeah and it does not add up <laughs> how do we get to plus 31 Oh well, I'm not going to complain. At least it's listed here and there. So we got an additional plus 17 and then it adds up to the uh, plus 15 that we would have here or plus 14. Yeah, plus 14. But in general, I'm quite happy with the looks of this district. So the plan with the having these islands is totally adding up. Good, time to get rid of the interface and take the thumbnail for today. And 
and screenshot. So, this was a little bit of a calmer episode. Let's see how it will develop in the future episodes. It will definitely be a bit more stressful because now I have these fuckers here to supply. Um, so, we will see. This um, is a magnet for genius. Another one is visiting Kebab Town. Captain Smith, Titan of the Sea. Welcome to you again. And here's also a quest. Credit where credit's due. After all, there's always something more to A this photography would be quest. The cherry on the cake. Yeah. So now with the uh, with the thumbnail taken, I'm pretty sure we will start with the glasses production in the next episode. I mean, the spectacle factories. We have all the mines necessary actually on this island. The the brass batteries are not good for the attractiveness value. So we might actually want to outsource that production here to Bayonet. And just create a trade route for the rare materials. That is probably going to be the solution to go. I mean, with that we also need less workforce, so we can build it here around. I just need to make room free for probably another trade union. But hey, so um, as always, I hope you liked it. If yes, please consider giving a thumbs up to this video. It's always a great feedback for me. And I know that I'm not that active these days, but uh, well, life and work, you know, um, stuff happens, um, but it could be worse. And still, as soon as I have time, I, I'm i recording something like this. It's always fun. And I always enjoy seeing that it is being appreciated to take the time. And yeah, if you have any feedback, suggestions or whatsoever, or just want to talk to me, then just type it down in the comments. I will make sure to read every comment available. If you want to get in touch with me directly, then, well, feel free to join our community Discord. You will find an invitation link in the video description down below. And uh, yeah, if you want to get notified whenever something new is uploaded to the channel, then make sure that you are subscribed to the channel and that notifications are activated. And with that, I'm going to say goodbye and see you in the next episode of NO1800. Bye-bye.